This is Project Sunset Furry. Moo! Welcome, everybody, to Project Sunset Furry. I'm Chaos Crazy. This is Zelda, Twilight Princess, of course, part 47. We're on the track of some pose. We got three pose down, and we've lit in three lights, but there are supposed to be four lights. There are Ah, four lights. And as you can see, there's one cent of a pole left, and it leads to this, which we already pulled. And we already went downstairs. So something tells me I've done this puzzle incorrectly. Incorrectly. And I was down here and I was trying to solve this puzzle before. And I was just like, what? How am I supposed to do that? How am I supposed to get... See? It does. It goes... It goes back up through there? I don't understand. It goes back up through there. What? <laughs> okay, I'm dumbfounded. What is a... Is there, like, uh... Can I lock on to something up there? No. Okay. So I did this before, and if I push this thing, I can't get out the door. That's that's the big problem. Is I am incapable of getting out the door because the wall moves away. That opens up. Is the hole in the top still there? Yes, it is. Now can I chain through it? I don't see anything to grab onto up there. Am I looking from the wrong way? Something if I... Yes, I am. Oh my god, sometimes I feel like such a dumbass. Like, really. Now I can get through into the top room, which has rotated this, and has opened the way for... Oh my god. Wow, that puzzle was so easy. Why didn't I think of that the first time? Ugh. Da, 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 da. Oh. Okay, we got lots of uh, lots of lanterns here, lots of blue lanterns. Is this gonna be even more pose than the last time when I really got? Hey, my sword gets stuck in the ground. That's kind of a cool feature there. Is this gonna be like even like super pose here? Oh, hold, that one's moving. Is that the only real one? Cause the rest of them don't seem to be coming off their perch. Let's, uh, wolf it up here. Hey, how's it going, buddy? Hey. It's not letting me grab him. Dude. There we go. That's a hit. Dude. That's a hit. Dude. That's a hit. Now get it. Get that soul. Smells good. Yeah, that pose soul. That's four pose souls. Oh my god, he died violently there. That was a violent death. And the light. The light will travel back. The light will set you free. Right. Anything else in here? Any money? I have 516 bucks, but by the end of this, I'm gonna need a lot of money. I'm gonna need money, 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 money. Greedy. Just want all the monies. Alright, so now that we're back in here, can we leave this room? No, we can't leave this room. Hey, rats. Make us go back downstairs and push the button again. Well, I guess that makes sense. Otherwise, you can, like, trap yourself out of the mechanical room, right? It makes sense. You don't want to trap yourself out. Drop him back down. Grab it. And push it. Alright. So back out here, we should now have all four pose souls. And this should open our way forward. Here comes the light. 
Why'd it go out through there? That was a weird exit point for it, but okay. The soul does what the soul wants to do. And the way forward is open. You would think that'd be a boss, but... We haven't even found the item in this dungeon yet. Haven't even found the item in this dungeon yet, so keep that in mind. This is where the real Dark Souls begins. <laughs> this is where the real dungeon begins. Dude, do that stab thing and I get stuck right in the ground. Get out of here. Alright. What the hell is that over there? Oh, that's my big key. But I'm not getting past the pit of doom yet. You can't lock onto a chest, apparently. Oh, and I just remembered which uh, which item this is. I did. I thought that was the next dungeon, but no. Apparently, now I can clearly see which item it is going to be here, and it makes perfect sense. You might see it too if you've never played this game. Then you might not have any freaking idea. But yes, now I know. I thought that was the next dungeon. I guess not. Hmm. Oh, hold it. No, 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 you no. Know, okay, I remember the item in the next dungeon now. Yeah, yeah, okay, it's all come back. Hey! Buddy? Where'd you come from? Alright, um. Do I just wanna. Can I grab onto that one down there? Okay, I can't, because I don't wanna just jump. Get out of here. Five bucks though. Okay, we have fire here. What else can I do? Can I yeah, okay. It's probably the same way back up. I wanna thoroughly inspect every portal we can get our hands on here. Yeah, it seems to be a pattern. Oh no, hold it. I wouldn't see the way back up. Hmm. Interesting. Hey! Don't fly away on me. Come fly away, come fly away with me. Well, I don't see the way back up. But that's okay. Because the bottom is where we want to be, right? So let's turn the whole room. Oh boy, hold it. This room? Oh, oh no. Seriously? Dude, no way. Well, it can't be far. Get a key, use a key, right? Okay. I think we keep... Yeah, we can keep going all the way up this jagged pole. All right, so, ah, there we go. That's probably where it is. Oh, you're not going to let me through there, huh? Well, I'm pretty sure I can just go around this way. Like, you know, that's not really going to stop me there, spikies. Like, who builds all these spikies? Who builds a trap to stop people coming with motion? And, like, it did nothing. You did nothing. You did nothing. What was the point? You wasted time. Somebody in the past wasted time building these spikes that come out of the wall. They did. They wasted their time. Alright. I want to make sure I leave. found the key. I want to leave no stone unturned. Okay, what does this lead to? doesn't seem to lead to anything of importance. Yet again, this is an even bigger waste of time. Why would they do this? Like, whoever was building this wonderful temple would have to be like, uh, excuse me boss, um, why are we doing this when, you know, we could just not build the secret entrance around and that would really keep people out? Whatever. All the way back down to the bottom we go. 
now that we have the key. The key is the key to everything. Oh, we're at the bottom. <laughs> Get a key, use a key. What's the saying? What's the rule? Repeat it back to me, everybody. Type it in the comments. Get a key, use a key. That's how the Twilight Princess is played. Okay? Get a key, use a key. So I knew that key wasn't far behind. It's not like freaking oot, you know, and that key could be anywhere in the freaking dungeon. Who the hell knows where that key is? Uh huh. I'm like, that looks like spiky things should come out. Where? So it is a maze. Yep. We have ourselves a spiky maze. Oh, oh, do, 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 do. Okay. A spiky maze. Go, 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 and across. Spikes. Spikes are there. Are you kidding me right now, dude? <sighs> Do we have invisible rats? Seriously? I think we might have invisible rats, too. Dude. Dude, thank you. Get out of here. Fucking invisible rats all over my body. Worst enemy ever. Invisible rats. Go, 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 go. Oh, okay. I thought that was gonna stop. No, okay, stop there. Not stopped here. Aha, uh -huh, a chain, okay. Chain will probably open the door, but how far across does it go? Okay, well that's not so hot. Get out of here, get out of here. Get out, get out, thank you. Get out of my ozone. Hey, I wanted to get the Wii Dead, not you. Hey, I went right through the Wii Dead. Come on. Get out of my ozone. You're in my ozone lair. This is where I come to breathe ozone. Okay, that falls down. Okay, so now that I know the path, I can now pull the chain. Working on the chain, chain. That's the sound of the game. Working on the chain, that's not how the song goes. But I can't think of it right now. Alright, we've done it. Seriously, do we have a rat on my body? Seriously? Where'd he come from? I thought I killed all the rats. It's hardly slowing us down. Will it slow us down enough? Probably not, no. Okay. Get off my body! Get off my body! Thank you. Frick. My body, my body, my body. Alright, we don't need this anymore. So let's get back to human land. The land of humans! Poor souls who died here, leaving their skulls behind. Alright, so, oops. Let's jog it to the middle. You can see these spiky things running across the wall. Go, 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 go. No! No! No, not the bugs again. Ah, oh, dude. Okay, get out of here. Not the bugs again. Seriously. Yes, the lantern will repel them. Oh, what's that? Oh! Well, look who it is. Whew. Free at last! Free at last! <laughs> Gracious, you're that nice fellow who helped me out the other day. How nice... The other day? I think it's been more than a day, but whatever. Well, 
now that we found each other again, let's stick together for a bit. Hmm? I'll be right with you, so if you want to warp out, just let me know. Thank you! You're a piece that will help me LP this game easier. So thank you. Uh, Mrs. Oroko. Alright. See, the bugs are repelled by the light. By the light! Let's keep going, though. What do we got here? We got more bugs. And... Like, the doom here. Dude, I thought I had... I had that on my belt. Look at this doom here. Lots of doom. It's over here. A freaking Triforce gate. Don't know where that leads to. It's over in this alcove. Nothing? Nothing in this alcove, huh? Alright. Running with my doom. Oh! Why, but this room, I kind of remember. I remember the shape of this room, at least. Because I'm in love with the shape of you. <laughs> uh, we keep saying our friend Calhoun, that looks like a significant shape to his body. Like, you can spot him from, like, miles away. So every time we see, like, anything that mentions the word shape, and the shape... <laughs> What shape are you in? <laughs> it's always about Calhoun. Just like, yeah, you can see the shape. That's the shape of Calhoun. <laughs> oh, 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 what? Sh oh, yeah. Oh, frick, I'm knocking these guys around like a Dingledorf. Forgetting that I need my bombs. Frick, this is a link to the past, man. You gotta link to the past it. Can bombs not blow up freaking these bugs? Oh, I'm out. I'm out of lantern juice. Seriously? I'm all out of lantern juice? That lantern juice goes quick, man. Look at that. A full lantern juice. Okay. Freaking bugs, man. Freaking bugs. Don't let the bug bed bugs bite. They are. Stay over here. Oh, frick, I didn't know there was going to be another one. Otherwise, I would have kept my bombs ready. Get out of my life. Thank you. Bomb. Ready. Drop it. Boom. Boom goes the dynamite. Luckily, maybe I won't use all my lantern juice before I can get back around to the beginning of this dungeon. Okay, can I not? No, I can't jump up there? Okay, we'll just go back and check out the door. Hey, 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 hey. Okay. Go and checking out that door. Put, no, put, put away. Go, go, go. Ah! I went too late. Now go. Go, 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 go. This will lead us to a secret passageway. No! No! Not bugs! No, not bugs! No, not bugs! No, 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 no. Stay away from me. Okay. This. Can't pull yourself up, but you can surely jump. Yes! Link, the power of jumping. The jumping power has possessed you to jump. Alright. We are on the verge of something. Something, something good. Something nice. And with that special door opening segue, you can feel it's coming. Special door, special door closed and locked behind you. You know shit's about to go down now when that door closes behind you. What do we got here? Looks like the top of a tent. Like those. What do we have here? It is a gigantic sword in the ground. That we cannot interact with. 
This door is not opening. We have to be a wolf? Let's, uh, let's get a sense about it. No? No, I don't see anything. Oh, oh. Oh, it didn't like that. It didn't like that I was trying to set it free, maybe. I don't know. It didn't need to be set free. It can set itself free. Now that's a big sword. A butcher's knife. Well, a really big butcher's knife. Alright, um, hold it. It's very strange. Somebody holding that sword? Somebody we can't see? Is there somebody holding this sword? Let's. There is. There is somebody holding the sword. Attack! Attack! Get the jugular! Oh! Oh my god! He looks vile and horrible. Can we now get him as Link? Come back down here. Come back down here. Don't shoot your resin magic at me. Your magical resin. Alright, should I get my... Maybe I should get my arrows ready. I think I might want to get my arrows ready. Oh, don't stand in the corner like that. Can't lock onto him. It's gonna be a game of tennis, maybe? Oh, no. Oh, there we go. That actually worked. Yes. Boom. My arrows actually worked. I didn't think it would either. This could be a game of tennis though. He is shooting magic at me and flying in the air. Kind of like a Ganon fight, right? Oh no. Either I failed or this isn't a game of tennis. We'll see if we try that again. Otherwise. Oh. Huh. Felt like a game of tennis? I guess it's not. Dude, seriously, you're gonna go invisible again? I don't got time for this kind of crap. Boom, 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 boom. Grab the jugular! Come on, and shoot to... Shoot the thrill. Shoot the kill. Whoa, he's flying around like a madman. Like a madman, I tell you. Slap him in the head. Slap that head around. Where's he going? Nope, missed. Boom. Come on. Come on. Flying around at the speed of sound. Gotcha now. I got you now, boom! Uh, my head! I got a concussion! Oh no! So it explodes. Is that a minion of Ganon? He's very Ganon-like, isn't he? Especially the sword, too. Very Ganon-like. But he doesn't mention that he's Ganon. He's just a mini-boss, too. But very reminiscent. Oh, we've jumped down. There's no going back now. But here is what we came for. You got the spinner! This ancient machine allows you to float in the air. Well, I wouldn't say that exactly. Set it, yeah, okay. Press the assigned button, yeah, okay. 
So I wouldn't exactly say float in the air, <laughs> um, but it's about as close to a hoverboard as you're going to get. See? It's actually pretty freaking cool. Um, but it doesn't really go very, like, doesn't. Really, it's hard to control and it doesn't really go very far. You don't get a lot of power with it unless you put it on the rails. You can't spin off and jump, but. Oh, was there something up? Hmm. Is there something up there? No, 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 no. I want to go. No. Okay, there we go. I want to go this way. Is there something up here? I go all the way up? Okay, I thought maybe there was, but no, it's just going to take me all the way around. I felt like a little bit of a... Oh, wow, I just sucked onto it, yes. Okay, so that felt like a little bit of a waste of time. But that's the gist of it. That's the gist of what this can do. We are going to see those rails all over Hyrule now. You might have seen some already. But we will make better use of them from this point forward. Now that we have the spinner. But in the next episode, it's uh, big key time. That's what we're going to work on next time is getting the big key. Now that we can spin, I uh, spin you right round, baby, right round like a, like a top, uh, like a record. What's a record? Hmm. Round, round, I spin you right round, baby, right round. Until then, I'm Mikael's Crazy. Please subscribe. Please leave a comment below. And of course, moo.